Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a sold-out show here in Green Bay, Wisconsin. I'm Michael Cole here with Taz and Ringside. Man, you couldn't fit another fan in here with a crowbar, I'm telling you. There's a whole lot of cheese heads in the house tonight. It sure is. Green Bay knows that they're about to see the greatest superstars in all, all of right. sports entertainment. I can't wait to get started. What a counter that Damn. was. And here's a little something for the fans. That's Three. why they love him. So you know what? Who cares what they think? All he's doing here is giving his opponent a chance to recover. I think John Cena has risen through the SmackDown ranks faster than any other superstar in recent memory. I can't re Nice reversal! He's been looking for that all match, Cole, and now he's taking advantage. Come on, partner, taking advantage is a rather generous way to put it. He's cheating, plain and simple. These superstars are on fire tonight. They sure are, and I don't think they're going to be put out anytime soon. And there's the counter, Cole. You know, Cole, I'd ask you who you were pulling for in this match, but I think it's pretty obvious since the beginning Man. who you're rooting for. I never claim to be completely objective, Three. Taz. It's no secret I respect superstars who stick within the rules Four. and show some sportsmanship in the ring. You gotta understand, Five. Cole. I know it ain't exactly kosher, but you're putting your body on the Six. line in there. You gotta do whatever it takes to protect yourself and pick up Seven. the win. Taz, you're talking about two different things. Going outside the rules in the name of self-defense is one thing. But cheating to steal a victory and enhance your own career is something completely different. I've been locked in this hole before, and it hurts even worse than it looks. I can't even imagine the amount of pain that this hole must inflict on any superstar who winds up in it. He anticipated that move perfectly. I think they're slowing their pace down a little bit, Cole. And that's a good way to refocus your energy, but you also give your opponent time to recover. That's not good. It certainly isn't. But if you try to rush things, you could wind up making a critical mistake that could cost you the match. I hope this isn't the last time we see these superstars face off. You're not going to hear me... This could be three right here. I don't think there's going to be anything left of these superstars by the end of this match. You're probably right, Taz. They're so focused on a victory that they don't care what they have to put themselves through to get it. I gotta tell you, I didn't expect these guys to go off on each other the way they have tonight. This has been brutal this match so far. Well, Taz, it's not ballet, you know. Oh, really, Paul? Gee, here I was wondering what happened to the pointy-toed shoes and the frilly little skirts. You know what? Maybe I should go check your closet. It's been a long time since I saw a crowd get behind a superstar the way they have for John Cena. Yeah, that's great, Cole. No doubt the WWE fans, they love John Cena. I get that. But this is not a popularity contest. It's a physical athletic competition. I don't think Cena's got any problem being physical either, Taz. There aren't many superstars who have accomplished what he has between those ropes. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hint of weakness in the other. That's the law of the jungle, Cole. And injured superstars like a wounded animal. It's survival of the fittest. And that also means that if you're not at 100%, you've got to be able to hide it from your opponent. You got that right, Cole. This business is as psychological as it is physical. 
You can't let your opponent think they're easy pickings. Well, I wouldn't consider any of these superstars to be easy pickings, no matter how beaten up they get. What an incredible match we've seen so far. And it ain't over yet, Cole. It sure isn't. I think these superstars could keep going for quite a while longer. That was a textbook reversal. You know what, this scene, he spends a lot of time running his mouth, Cole. If it was me, I'd put a little bit more energy into proving my in-ring skills. Seeing as the WWE Champion, Taz, how much more improvement do you really need? I know the guy's on top. I understand that. He's WWE Champion. I understand that. Sometimes it's easier to become champion than stay champion. Seeing a match like this makes me proud to be part of this company. I'm with what a deadly submission hold this is. We might see a tap out right here. It won't surprise me one bit. The longer you stay in this, the more risk you have for serious injury. He saw that one coming. You know, there's no doubt that The Undertaker is one of the most impressive superstars ever to set. What a reversal! The thing you gotta remember about The Undertaker is that, you know, instead of showboating to the fans, maybe you should really keep your head to this match. Come on, Taz. You're looking at a superstar who can feed off a crowd and use that energy to win the match. One. Hey, the ref's got a tough job. I mean, One. trying to keep these superstars on the up and up, that's hard. Well, it's easier to get some superstars to play by the rules than others. Hey, you know what, Cole? If you're going to get on your high horse again and give us another lecture about playing fair, I swear to God, I'm going to throw up. Is it so wrong to ask a superstar to play by the rules, Taz? That doesn't seem to be so unreasonable to me. That's because you never competed in a match, Cole. If you did... You know that you gotta do whatever it takes to win. And if that means bending the rules a bit, well then, that's just the way the cookie crumbles. Conditioning's a huge factor in any match. If you can't go the distance, there ain't no way you're gonna win. That's for sure, Taz. And the WWE superstars are some of the best conditioned athletes in the world. This match is even considered that they might not walk out the way. I'm sure they have it, Paul. That's the kind of attitude that Three. gets you beat quicker than anything. As soon as you let the slightest doubt Four. into your mind, you can forget about it. And that's something I don't Five. think people realize. The mental conditioning of the WWE Six. superstars is just as impressive as the physical conditioning. Seven. Eight. He was one step ahead on that one. Talk about adding insult to injury. And these fans love it. Yeah, well, you know what? He better worry more about the injury and less about the insult until his match is over. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? This is one hell of a performance by some amazing superstars, Cole. What did you expect, Taz? This is SmackDown, after all, the number one brand in sports entertainment. He slipped out of that one. And I think these superstars are going to keep it up until they've got literally nothing left to give. Holy cow, Cole, look at that. Talk about a crimson mask. It's unfortunate, but you always run that risk in a match like this. Unfortunate? What the hell are you talking about? This is great! One. Two. 
You know, I know I say this a lot, Cole, but this is not ballet. You step between those ropes, you better be prepared to take some punishment. And to dish some out as well. I don't think I've ever seen a superstar win a match by being a tackling dummy. This is not just a match anymore, Cole. These superstars have got a legitimate beef with each other. They do indeed. There's a lot of bad blood here for sure. And if this keeps up much longer, that bad blood's gonna wind up all over the place. Folks will be staying with this match to the end with no commercial interruptions. Good thing too, Cole, because I don't think we'd ever hear the end of it if we cut away here. You're probably right, Taz. I know I wouldn't want to miss a second of this action. Oh my, the submission hold is locked in. And this ain't easy to get out of either, Cole. Man, I don't envy that ref. You know, the last place I'd want to be is between these superstars. You can say that again. Talk about hazardous to your health. One. One. I don't think Dude. there's ever been a more dominant superstar in WWE than the legendary Three. dead man, The Undertaker. Yeah, but you can only Four. stay on top of the mountain for so long. And the dead man's been there for a wow. very, very long time. I've said it before, and I'll say it again. Nothing Six. costs you a match quicker than overconfident. He's had enough. Seven. This could be it. This is it. The last Eight. line. Oh, God. You can just feel the impact from here. Nine. You know, you can show off for the crowd all you want, but all that does is let your opponent rest up. Actually, Taz, I think it's a great display of confidence on the part of this great superstar. You know, the key to winning a match like this is to build some momentum. And you're not going to see a match won with just one or two moves. No, but one or two big moves at a crucial point could change the direction of it completely. I think it's only a matter of time before we see a submission. That would certainly be the smart move to make. This one could still go either way, Cole. It sure could. It's not over until the referee calls for the bell. I think we're about to see a high-risk move from the top rope. There's the reversal, Cole. These superstars certainly aren't going easy on each other tonight. They sure are giving the fans their money's worth. No doubt, Cole. These WWE superstars put their bodies on the line night after night. And the fans sell out these arenas night after night, Taz. Sounds like a pretty fair trade to me. Looks like they might be taking this match down a notch here, Cole. The pace of the match may have slowed, but the intensity of these superstars certainly hasn't. You can say that again. Waiting for your opponent to make a move or give an opening can be just as intense as putting him through a table. And whether... I think we know where he's going with this, Cole. Here it comes. The FU! He just drove his opponent straight into the ground. On the mat, shoulders down. One, this could be two, it. Two, three. And the crowd is coming. What a match. I got goosebumps.